Game on, GameStop. Walmart Stores Incorporated, the world's largest retailer, plans to expand its current online video game trade-in program by allowing customers to trade their used games at the company's 3,100 stores in exchange for credit towards the purchase of other items. The Associated Press reports. GameStop Corporation currently dominates the $2 billion used video game market. Walmart's new program is the most serious challenge to GameStop, which for the last three years has drawn roughly half of its profits from buying and selling used video games, the AP said. FedEx posted lower than expected returns Wednesday, blaming the winter weather for its poor profit results. The world's number two package delivery company reported it expects to earn $6.55 to $6.80 a share for the full year, while analysts were expecting earnings up at $6.89 a share, according to Reuters. The release of information from FedEx is the first example of just how the harsh winter will affect the shipping industry in the country as temperatures ran below average for two full months. Amid concerns over the possibility the cars could catch fire, Porsche announced it will replace the engines in all of its current model year 911 GT3 sports cars and told current owners not to drive the vehicle. Volkswagen AG released the statement Tuesday, followed by the automaker's recall last month of all 785 model year 2014 911 GT3 cars because of concerns over the possibility they could catch fire when in operation. Porsche was investigating two engine fires in which loosened fastener caused oil to leak and the oil caught fire. Reporting from Millionaire Corner, I'm Heather Kiley. Thanks so much for watching.